so yeah, I'm uh, doing the uh, um, update for Awakening Health. Uh, Awakening Health is developing human-like robots and avatars for the medical space. Our first robot and avatar is Grace, and one of our first roles in healthcare will be working with seniors as a social companion and a nursing assistant. Our aim is the creation of AI personas who are compassionate and emotionally intelligent. Grace will get to know you. You'll, you'll be able to form a connection and bond with her. She'll give people a sense of being seen, of being heard, a, a feeling of being emotionally connected and understood and without judgment, only with compassion and love. <clears throat> I believe she'll change the way we experience ourselves and others. In addition to this relational value, Grace, of course, will also provide tremendous levels of concrete and transactional value in healthcare, impacting the health and well being of many, many people. We have a great team of talented people working on the project in locations around the world in Hong Kong, St. Petersburg, Russia, Bangalore, Mexico, the United States. And over the last year, there's been a lot of hard work and progress in creating a prototype version of Grace. And it's exciting to be at this point. We'll be putting Grace in front of more people, having her interact with seniors and other people for product testing and development, and also for medical research purposes. I'm not going to go through all the areas of development and progress that have happened because there are a lot, but some of them are advances in capabilities such as Grace being able to meet people and learn their names and faces and recognize them later, finding someone in a room, learning information about them and being able to recall it later, enhancing emotional intelligence by detecting people's emotions through their facial expressions and voice qualities. And we've created a new innovative dialogue system that uses the OpenCog Atom space. And uh, we're also working on allowing her to be able to speak to people in different languages. We're also forming some interesting product partnerships and medical research partnerships that will lead us to doing clinic, clinical trials next year we have uh, a part, we're partnering with the lab at McGill University, as well as working with a leading researcher in Alzheimer's and dementia at Boston University. There's a project beginning with an independent researcher who has developed innovative mind and emotion stimulation pro protocols that could potentially help people with cognitive degenerative diseases like Alzheimer's and stroke vi victims. And uh, partnering with a um, hospital system in Florida that's very excited about uh, getting Grace in, in, into their hospital and interacting with people, as well as a psychiatrist with expertise in AI for diagnoses, looking at monitoring psychiatric patients and assessing risk. And uh, also some interesting product partnerships, one with a VR company in Korea, creating a Korean version of Grace for their metaverse, and working on a potential partnership with a medical education company, as well as a major hospital and healthcare system in the Middle East and North Africa. So it's an exciting time for Awakening, and I feel grateful and honored to be working on the project. Um, there are great forces pushing for the evolution of AGI, and we are midwives at the forefront of introducing humanoid robots and avatars into the world of people. So I, I feel uh, honored to, to be part of that and to be working with this great team of people.